Alola friends, Dapper Drabby here, and welcome back to another day on the uh, Nonchalant Nuzlocke. Let's go ahead and take a look at our team. We have the Creep at level 11, Gem at level 10, Victor at level 11, Smalls at level 10, and Rufio at level 11, and then we recently caught Bruce at level 7. So, a pretty interesting team. Um, let's the creep, I guess, is in front right now. I guess let's go ahead and move the creep around with Jim. Um, kind of want to start things off with Jim and Smalls here because they have full HP. We'll, we'll go ahead and move the creep down here where Bruce is. So we can try to evenly share the love. Um, but let's go ahead. Continue where we left off. We're headed to the back side of this, uh, this little beach here. I don't know if you guys knew about this little space. There's another mantine over here. Um, some water that leads to nowhere. What's this guy say? The mantine are really chill. They don't care if someone's riding them. Or even if a Pokemon called Remoraid clings to them. Favorite evolution line is Mantike evolving into Mantine. Where you need a Remoraid in your party in order to evolve it, which is kind of funny. What does this lady say? Everyone seems to be able to pull off killer moves in the moment they climb atop Mantine. Why do they keep me as instructor? What's this Pikachu Muka want? It's staring at you. Um, turn to the right. Oh, I was like, it's not as smart as a uh, as a rock ref. Turn to the left. Turn to the left. Stare at it. Question mark. Oh, it actually likes it. Nice. Stare at it longer. It turned right. Turned to the right. I like this. Play peekaboo. Boo. Like that. Um, bye bye. Does it follow me around like the rock ref does? No. Oh, it does, doesn't it? Oh my god. It's creepy. A little puky muka. Following you. Like a little slug sort of thing. Um, it looks like it's all you can do back here in the back in the beach. Let's go ahead and continue our journey down Route 2. Ooh, we have a, a battler here, too. We got a battle car, uh, the surfer up here. Hey, partner, how do you like my nice, smooth, shiny body? Whoa. Whoa, what does that mean? Uh, I'm gonna say it's cool. Or I need an adult. Uh, special order made for materials. Lightweight and bright red. Um, cool. Good for you. Go ahead and battle this surfer. Alola, Dryalgo, have you ever, have never seen a surfer before? I don't know, it's an, it might be a new trainer class, actually. Have I seen a surfer before? You challenged by Surfer Carlton. I don't know why I'm giving him that voice. Apparently I can do that a lot easier than some other ones. He's got the shady penguin. He's got the penguin that's so shady. Let's astonish it. How astonishing. Flinch, 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 flinch. He got the flinch. Nice one, gem. Another flinch, right? Aw, present. Can I have something good? Look, it's Christmas already, guys. We're getting presents from Deli Birds. It's Christmas time. Flinch it again. Now some stab. And we got it. Deli Bird has fainted. Murkrow has taken it. Ooh, and leveled up one. Nice. Learned Haze. I'll ride waves even when I'm not feeling it. That's what surfers do after all. 
received pittance for money. That's why you have to use the rock rough happy hour. Just so you can get more cash flow. Okay, I think I'm done over here. Um, what's this guy looking for? <laughs> oh, what? Oh, what am I to do? Uh, what's wrong? <laughs> My precious little me out is lost. Uh, it's so very timid and shy, so I'm not sure where it must be hiding someplace. Oh, oh my poor, poor Mia. My heart breaks just thinking about you. I want to find you and hug you and love you. That's a little odd. Please, will you help me find my Mia? Um, can I do it later? No, I'll share it. Why not? <gasps> thank you, thank you, my hero. My Meowth loves the shadowy spaces under tires and beneath trees. Oh, where could it have gone? Um, there's a tree over here. You're looking for Meowth? Someone go dashing towards that car a little while ago. Now look, she gives you the answer right there. So there's a car over here. And it should prompt you with an A button, I believe. I need to go back here. There it is in the front. Meow. Meowth is crouched beneath the car, trying to scare you off. Look away from it! Oh wow, we caught it. Oh my precious Meowth! Thank goodness you weren't hurt! Meow. Oh, Meowth, I'll never let you go again. Oh, I just want to rub your cheek on mine. You're so soft. My beard is so scratchy. <coughs> Meowth looks exhausted after all the loving from its trainer. This little rascal's always running off and making me worry. Thanks for helping me find it, though, there, uh, Charles. Since you, you're so speedy and skillful in helping me, this is a quick reward. There's a special set of mind to pick your pace and boost your power and balance. What does that mean? X speed? I don't know if I need that. Ooh, X attack. I might use that. And an X special attack? Let me at home, Meowth. Once you get there, we can cuddle even more. Run away, run away, Meowth. There you go. Okay, so uh, that was a waste of time, right? Let's move on into the new part of Route 2. Oh, there's a guy that wants to battle, but he didn't indicate with us that he wants to battle. My Mirko just loves shiny, sparkly things. Mine too. That's why his name is Jim. Hey, gentleman Stanley. What is Stanley here doing today? Go, Jim! It's the Mirko off. Who will win? Murkrow versus Murkrow. I think I'm just gonna peck. And I'm faster, that's right. Oh, that hurt. Yep, I'm not leaving you. Makes sure it's a not very effective move though. Helps me greatly. There we go. Look at it. Look at Jim. Jim taking on his duplicate. Showing him what how. You must shine brighter. My Murkrow is shining just fine apparently. It took out your Murkrow. Easy. Easy mode. Um, I don't know. I'm hiding by the building. We're going to the berry field in just a moment. Um, I just want to move smalls to the front. Now that we have everything pretty evenly leveled up at level 11. I think I need to get a few more levels before the uh, Verdant Cavern. But I think it should be possible. What's this guy want? Oh, you and Meowth are doing the island challenge. Great. Allow me to give you a berry then. Orin berry. Orin berry. Spore health. You can feed a berry to a Pokemon, and we already know this. Sure, I want to be the Bobby Master. Get a Prism Berry. 
I got it. It's right behind you. Oh no, there's more. Let me see. Did you get a prison berry? Whoa, you have a prison berry. I don't have. I don't know if you picked it from a berry tree or if you got a had a Pokemon that had it, but that's a great start to becoming a berry master. All oh, for you, this is a reward. A citrus, nice. Prison berries, person berries, heals confusion, and petri berries heal poison. Citrus berry heals more HP than a normal berry. Bird. Bird. Don't say 13. And I am. Silver Palter. Do we have a bug type that can use Silver Palter? I don't think so. And a Deli Bird? Okay, which one of these is Shady Penguin? Flat. This one? This one? You. <laughs> Pull the revive out of somewhere? That's shady. It's pretty shady of you. Pull a revive out of somewhere. Hey, move, move. Move, birdies. I need to get that sticker. Sticker. Too many birds in here. How are birds good at burying? I don't get it. Um, we could check out this, but I don't think it's very much. Maybe say hi to the girl. These are berry fields, but they aren't have any berries. Trees grow in here. You know why? Yes, I do actually know why. Because, well, you see, we came here to a lower region. I think it helped spread the word about using fertilizer on the berry fields here, too. The town we were here from is called a play place called Camp Fear Town in Kalos. Grows plenty of berries in the nearby fields, but we use fertilizer to help grow our berries. Now, but in the Alola region, people don't have to do the thing to help berries grow. You can sit back and let nature and Pokemon do all the work. You have more berries than you know what to do with. And that's why we stopped bothering trying to farm the fields here. In fact, now we're one of, now we're the ones who are enamored with the Alolan berry culture. My new dream is to become a true berry master here in Alola. So, what's the point of the fields then? I guess to peruse, wander around, get items hidden in the corner like big mushrooms. Then we need to sell, or we can wait. I, I think we can just sell it. Okay, moving on from the berry fields, we'll say how to road him here, because he's looking a little tired. It did nothing, okay. Ooh, what's this? Ooh. <coughs> yes, I see, so this is this is the way ver lies Verdant Cavern. It, it is one of the places in this land filled with the Blinding One's power. Most certainly worth our investigation. Yup. The aura levels there are really high. Calm yourself, Zossi. It'll be difficult for us to investigate, though, since we don't have Pokemon of our own. We will have to think of some other way. Perhaps we could use our technology to find a way to control Pokemon. Maybe you could go in as a trial goer. Take on the trial and everything. Though, though, I don't know. I don't have one of those island challenge amulet thingies. I like changed her voice on the spot because I didn't remember what I said. Her, her first. Those folks, what do you think they're here for? Sweating in those skin tight suits. Signs. Read signs. Everybody read signs. Uh, what can we do here? Now, this sucks because I really wanted to wait till this grass before getting an encounter. But I was feeling like we were low on encounters. So I had to pick up the creep. Speaking of the creep, there he is right there. It's another creep for ya. And let in meow. Forewarned. Let's go ahead and uh, take out. Get that flinch off. 
And then let's go ahead and bite this drowsy from making those snide remarks at us, saying that Lonely Meowth is not as good as Kanto Meowth. He is incorrect in his thinking. I was hoping to get an encounter over here because without the the run-up encounter, oh, I thought it'd be something different. There's actually a growl that I think Cutie Fly is over here, and Cutie Fly would help me get through this whole uh, island. So I thought that'd be a great one. But maybe we can catch Cutie Fly in the melee melee meadow. Smalls grew to level 11. So we're getting levels left and right. Straight back and forward, you know. Let's see if we can get uh, Smalls up to level 11 or uh, uh, level 12. There's nothing back there? What's up here? There's an item. What's the item? A revive. Something we don't really use because we are playing Nuzlocke rules. So definitely something we can sell for the money. I'm looking for berries to have my Pokemon hold. That reminds me, I should have made my Pokemon hold a berry. We are challenged by Pokemon Breeder Jay. You like if your name is Jay and you are this Pokemon Breeder. The big old mustache. <gasps> He's got a rock ruff. An adorable rock ruff. Where'd you get that, dude? I had to take mine from the internet. Where'd you get yours? Okay, so let's go ahead. Bite, I think? It's the most effective. There we go. Rock refuse. Weird. Yikes. Let's bite him again. Yeah, man, I'm doing very well with these with this team right now. Each one of them is able to hit like three shot stuff. Oh, if I only had given Rockruff a berry to hold, probably. Yeah, it would have healed it. Would have like overkilled it, healed it. Okay, let's avoid grass, and I think we're gonna end up running into how here. How you doing? How's it, Dapper Drabby? Your Pokemon doing all right? Yeah, fine. Well, I know, Papalu and the rest of my team have seen better days, that's for sure. Look at here. He's the Pokemon center. Come on, Dapper Drabby, let's stop at the PMC. You know that Vernon Cavern place, right? I guess it's kind of like sacred to Tapu Koko. You aren't even allowed to go in unless you're on the island challenge. Oh yeah, almost forgot. I have something pretty amazing to share with you, Dabber Drabby. You lucky thing. Three revives. Wow, they really expect you to kill off your Pokemon this early in the game. Revived are solid items to have. If your Pokemon faints in a battle and can't go on, then revive them. We'll pick them right back up. But you probably won't find revives here. Did you know that Pokemart sometimes sell different things? No, not just that. Two... The two clerks at the counter even sell different things from one another. Oh yeah, but you got a Rotom Dex, right? If you tap it and play with it a lot, then you can use Rotolata, right? That's right, give me a tap with my eyeball slash. Awesome, do it, Dabber Drabby. Do it, try Rotom Rotolata for me. Hey kid, check out the Rotolata. Just touch my eyes when they're flashing and see what you get. Ooh, congratulations. We can use the Rotolato now, and it's a new feature that pops out of special powers just like that. Come on, give it a try. It's, it's just spinning, I don't get it. I don't touch it. Up! The up arrow. Hey, looks like that an amazing power. Two Roto Boost. What does that even mean? Is a Roto Powers pocket? Roto boost power is the um, boost the stats of your Pokemon. 
So it's like an X attack? That's so cool! Rotolano can even make your team stronger! I wonder what kind of Rotom powers there are here, too. Oh, I'm only here. That's some special Rotom power. Hope it helps us with the trial. Full team of six guys. We got Smalls and the rest. Sorry, I'm tired a little bit. <laughs> Thanks for waiting, Neos, and the rest of your team are feeling all better. We hope to see you again. And Rome keeps talking. Give you a moment. You live in here, Lola, right? I'd have to ask a favor. Do you mind? No problemo. Wow, thank you so much. I'm glad you would listen to my total chorus for like me. Uh, I'm actually here in Lola with my darling hubby in our honeymoon. When we were looking at berries, we saw this Pokemon Crabrawla. My darling hubby fell in love at first sight with Crabrawla. Anyway, I wanted to ask you if you could catch one of those Crabrawlers for me. Uh, uh, and I know if uh, what kind of Pokemon it is, then I can probably go catch one myself. You may be able to find Crabrawla in a pile of berries. That's where you found one, right? If you catch one of them, come back and show me. It's a Pokedex entry. I can pay you for your trouble. So I'll go catch a Crabrawler at some point, guys. You know where I'm sleeping? My really cool you comes into... Comes in at some point and falls asleep on my tummy. Interesting, dude. What did she say? If you give your Pokemon berries to hold, then they can eat them when they need in battle. But manufacturing healing items like potions are too good for held items. Pokemon can't use them on their own. Hello, you're a Pokemon trainer, aren't you? Have you caught a sparrow? Have you charged my Halucha? No. I see. Change your mind. Let me know. Super Potion, Nest Ball might be interesting. Luxury Ball, we can buy at least two of those. Okay, let's see what else do we need. Um, I think we're good on the rest of the stuff. We'll put six Super Potions in the bench here. And what does the first guy have? Standard Pokeball and Junk. Standard Pokeball and Junk, guys. Okay, let's get out of this center of misery. Uh, so we're ready for the Burnt Cavern. I see berries. Yeah, I think this grass up here has like cutie flies mostly. Chesto Resto. Just a resto. And number three berry is a Lepa berry. Pretty sure every time I ran into this grass, it's an encounter. Cutie fly, like I said, it is here. Unfortunately, I gotta swat it out of the sky because it is uh, not what we're looking for. Looks like it's about time to wrap up, guys. I think we're going to beat this cutie fly. Didn't get a lot done today. We kind of got finished up the Big Wave Beach and headed up Route 2. Uh, next time, we will head into the Verdant Cavern. And look for that. Um, it might be a week before I post again. Let's look for that in the new year. In the new year, we're going to take on our first trial. There you go. Meowth, and you didn't even faint. Um, that would have made me look silly. So we have, there's a, there's a trial captain right there. We have a few more, uh, a few more trainers. I think there's another trainer so we can catch up over here. Um, and then we'll go ahead and face Ilima. So thank you guys so much for coming out today. Ooh, Pokeball. Um, this has been Dapper Drabby. Um, I'll bid you guys aloha, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye-bye now.